Hey there, friends. It's great to have you join me again for another episode of my City Skylines 2 Beta Showcase. Today, I'm thrilled to present the third episode of Westdale 2, giving you a sneak peek before the official release on October 24. In the last episode, we built our way up from a grand village to a big town. And in this episode, we're going to take things up a notch and expand our city with all sorts of new infrastructure like highways, train networks, skyscrapers, and more. So grab your popcorn, sit back, and let's get started. The road tools have become much more user-friendly and convenient, especially when building highways and interchanges. One of the most exciting new features is the ability to construct entry and exit ramps for highways with proper acceleration and deceleration lanes that merge seamlessly with the highway itself. Plus, the game now has a parallel mode feature that was previously only available through mod in City Skylines 1. It's super helpful in constructing both functional and aesthetically pleasing parallel highways. construction now includes a new addition known as roundabout that can be erected on pre-existing intersections with relative ease. To construct a roundabout, one simply needs to select the desired size and position it. There are several size options available ranging from petite suburban roundabouts to massive ones that can accommodate multiple lanes. Once established, the roundabout adapts to the existing lane configuration of the connecting roads and adjusts the lanes to accommodate all exits. Vehicles adhere to roundabout traffic regulations when entering and exiting the intersection.
As you can see in the video, one new feature is traffic accidents in which cars lose control and collide with other cars or buildings. It might occur based on the weather, a disaster or the condition of the roads or the lighting. The police and road maintenance must respectively secure and clear accident scenes. In the simulation, traffic is stopped in the lanes that are affected by the collision and moving vehicles must wait until the road has been cleared before proceeding. If the collision is bad enough to result in significant casualties, ambulances may also be requested to the scene.
Thanks so much for watching this video. If you enjoy it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content like this. I hope you found this video helpful or entertaining or maybe even both. I really appreciate all of your support and love seeing your comment and feedback. Before we go, I want to let you know that the next episode of Westdale 2 will soon be released. So be sure to stay tuned for that. Also, if you have any suggestions for future video topic or any questions, please leave them in the comment section below. Thank you again for watching and I'll see you in the next video.